Hey guys, this is me, 80 Swarm from 4. So today, guys, I'm going to talk to you about the Grenada 1, USA 7, guys. USA have won 7 goals to 1 against Grenada. This was a fantastic win. Amazing, amazing win for the U.S. And it pretty much ensures that we will be, we have got 7 points and we have officially qualified to the Gold Cup. And now we just play the last game against Honduras. And basically, as long as we draw that game, we will basically top the group and go to the CONCACAF Nations League semifinals. Now, despite the fact that we did win by a huge score line margin, there are still some flaws with the game, which we'll discuss. Of course, I'll discuss the positives later on in the video. I just want to discuss the negatives first. Okay. First of all, number one is that that trusty guy, I don't think he's good enough for that team. I think we can tell that the guy was a bit inexperienced. He, he wasn't that great defensively speaking. You know, some, sometimes when Grenade were pushing forward, he was a bit liable at the back. And so I do think that if we're, I, I do think that he is someone that we can maybe get away with in these kind of games. But when it comes to like high tier games, for example, games like against Mexico, Canada, Jamaica potentially, basically against like top opposition, I don't think he is good enough against those kind of teams. I know it's really early, you know, maybe he can improve as things go on, and so forth. I also think that the whole um, um, positioning with um, what is it called um. Um, I think for me, Luca De La Torre did a good job in the CDM position. You know, I was happy to see that it worked. And I feel like for me, Reyna didn't really get involved in much in the game as I w wanted to. He had some little uh, sparks here and there, but I feel like for me, Reyna was a bit underwhelming on the day. Um, I kind of like, was expecting a little bit more from him on the day. He was still he was still good, obviously. I mean, I think there was that one chance where he got dribbled inside the box. He did a nice dribble there. He was taken down to the box. Unfortunately, no penalty was given. Um, and so, I feel like for me, Reyna was a bit underwhelming in that regard. Um, Aronson as well was good. That was a nice goal he scored. Obviously, Pepe was good as well. Him getting his form back, you know, he really needed this form, especially not being picked for the World Cup. So, he made a statement out there and performed. Pulisic, I thought, was really good in the camp position. I thought he was excellent. For me, probably the man in the match, you know, was amazing for those, you know, putting that assist there for the Pepe and putting the assist there for the McKinney goal. Absolutely fantastic. Um... I think Scally for me was a bit disappointing. I didn't think it was that amazing. Uh, Turner I thought was pr pretty good, although he didn't really have much to do in goal, despite that long shot effort they had, which was a spectacular goal, by the way. And yeah, I just think that the U.S. in particular, it was nice to see Zendaya also had a good impact coming off the bench. Yunus Musa was okay. DK wasn't really that good. And I think for the U.S., man, it was a big, big win. A huge, huge win for the U.S. And um, like I said before, our next game is against El Salvador, which will be a lot more difficult because El Salvador... Is actually going to be put things on. They're going to be a lot more defensively solid. I think they're going to give much more of a difficult game. I still expect us to win, of course, uh, but it's going to be a lot more harder than this. And I think we're going to have to play a, a little bit. We're going to have to be a little bit more better defensively if you want to beat El Salvador. And of course, we have to ensure our attack stays the same as it is. So, like I said, very good win. Happy with the three points. And uh, yeah, what do you guys comment down below? Your thoughts in the comments below, guys. Very very short match reaction, guys. So, you guys enjoy. Comment your thoughts, comment below, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.